Before we get started, make sure y'all like, subscribe, and share this video. If you'd like to purchase some shirts, the DLC store link is in the description down below. Okay, so here we go. Disney's Robin Hood, Bows and Arrows. Thanks, Mr. Hood. Skippy Bunny hopped around holding the bow and arrow Robin Hood had just given him. This is the best birthday present in the world. Want me to show you how to use it? Robin asked. Yes, cried Skippy. See, you put this here. Robin lined the arrow up with the bow, then pulled here and let it fly. The arrow soared through the air and landed in the center of a tree trunk across the yard. Wow, Skippy cheered. That's nothing, Robin said. He handed an apple to Skippy. Here, put this on the head of that scarecrow. Sure thing, Robin, Skippy said and hurried off. As soon as the apple was in place, Robin let another arrow fly. It zipped through the air and hit the apple, neatly slicing it in two. Can I try? Skippy asked. All right, Robin said, placing a new apple on top of the scarecrow's head. Skippy pulled back the bow. But when he let go, the arrow landed only a few inches in front of him. That's okay, Robin said. It happens to the best of us. Even you, Skippy X? Well, not me. I never miss. Robin boasted as he pulled back his bow. Just as he did, Maid Marion's carriage rolled by. Robin's head turned and his hand slipped off the bow. The arrow fell to the ground a few inches in front of him. Skippy giggled. What's so funny? Robin asked crossly. Nothing, Skippy said, hiding a smile. <laughs> As you can see, Robin said, even the most experienced archers lose their focus occasionally. <laughs> but it helps if you think of a goal and keep your goal in mind while you draw the string back. Aim and let go. I like to think about setting the sheriff's pen so far. <laughs> what? <laughs> Skippy decided to give it a try. He pulled the string back and then he let it go with a twang. The arrow sailed through the air and split the apple in two. Robin's trick had worked. The end.